Right. A couple of couple of questions on the back of that. Mike Penrose, uh, Ujwal telling us there that the army's been put in control of, of logistics to a certain degree. Good idea? Uh, in almost any national disaster like that, it is the army that takes control. I think I, I heard uh, nine out of ten Nepalese soldiers have been mobilized. Uh, in the Pakistan earthquake, nobody could have got or reached the areas worst affected if it hadn't have been for the military. And the same uh, goes for um, uh, the work in Aceh. Now, in, in a lot of conflict environments, we would advocate very strongly against uh, military engagement with humanitarian aid. But in a natural disaster like this, it's everyone, everyone who has a pair of hands needs to get involved. Everyone who has a pair of hands. And uh, the, uh, um, you heard the, the call there from Ujwal saying they're doing the best they can, but we still need more uh, coordination. We need more presence. We always need more, um, but as we're saying, one of the biggest problems is how do you get the volume that's needed? We're talking about three million people now who are already identified as being affected, with probably far more when we, we get greater access being affected. Getting that sheer volume in and getting the number of people in that are needed to help is an almost impossible task. Coordination is, is essential. But we also know the basics of what are needed early on, and agencies just need to mobilise as quickly as possible.